I'm gonna do a little shameless plug right now. Like, share, demon on unfuse. Do not forget to watch it. So today I'm going to do my first makeup tutorial and like I promised you guys, I'm going to do it with the MAC Selena. Usually before I put on my makeup, I use this vitamin E oil. I'll show you a picture of it. But today I want to do something different and I want to try the ELF Luminous Putty Primer. Never tried this before. This is my bare face. This is what I look like. And what this is supposed to do is that it's supposed to fill in your pores. So we're gonna try it. We're gonna see if it's real. We're gonna see if it's true. That glow. Do I already see a difference in the luminous glow because it's already a little more shinier here than it is here. They said put a thin layer, but you know me, you say sajeras. So I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit and I'm gonna drink a little bit of coffee. Mm. I don't know if you need to let it sit. But I like to let everything sit, like my emotions, my anger problems. Um, maybe I'm a bit passive aggressive. So what I'm going to put on next is orange corrector. This orange corrector is good for people's complexion who are like mine and darker, just to conceal the dark circles underneath your eyes. I already see the difference. I don't see any darkness underneath my eyes. All I see is a lot of orange. <laughs> I feel like I'm orange enough, right? So orange what girl. I'm gonna do now is pray to God that this orange comes girl. out exactly how I pictured it to be. So I'm gonna pray a little bit. God, please don't make me look a fool for this. So now moving on to the Superstay Maybelline, New York. Me and this foundation first met at a CVS store and it was when I was at my lowest and I couldn't find any good foundation and I couldn't find the beauty within myself. And I looked at it, I saw it was almost out and I'm like, hm, if it's almost out, then it gotta be good. And I still, I mean, I bought the last one that was left and ever since then our journeys have been inseparable. Let's see if it, if the orange hides well underneath this. The red is disappearing. Like my relationships. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. My whole face is concealed, bitch. What's good? Where the orange at? That's how you know I'm losing it because ain't nobody talking to me. All right, so this is the baking part. And the brand that I use for this is Derma Blend. I love Derma Blend. I really do. I think it's a really, 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 really good brand. The powder that they have, I don't really feel it. <coughs> I know Brother Padre. Del Hijo, del Espíritu Santo, come in. Oh, you know what I didn't do? My fucking eyes. So don't do this at home, guys. You're supposed to do concealer before you put on the powder. Oh my God, I made it worse. So I made it worse and I'm gonna have to start all over again. When I think about giving up, I think about why I'm doing this. And I'm doing it for Selena! All right, so now I'm gonna go on to concealer. This is what I forgot to put on my face before I put on the powder. There's a lot of crow's feet, so I wanna make sure that I, that I get those fucking cross feet. And they leave my face once and for all. I do use the Anastasia Beverly Hills from Amreezy. I'm not a makeup artist, but I know what makes my features stand out. And so I take this and I go like. So right now what I'm gonna do is the lip liner. This is the Selena VJ. In Spanish, when we see two L's together, the pronunciation is J, para que no me jodan. 
And I'm gonna just get a nice little outline on my lip. For those of you who don't understand the purpose of lip liner, lip liner is like the original lip filler. So when you feel like your lips aren't plump enough, you take a lip liner and you outline your lip to where you'd like your lips to actually be and then you color it in. So I'm debating. I don't know if I want to mix it with this lipstick. I'm a little torn. I don't know which three to choose. I think that I it's going to look cute if I mix it up with a brown. So we're going to do it with the La Reina. So I'm just going to mix these two. Yup. Here we go, yo. Here we go, yo. So what, so what, so what's the scenario? This is the typical Sasha look. Now I'm gonna use the Maxilina eyeshadow. Look at how beautiful the shimmer is. You're supposed to put this on before you put your whole face. Cause you don't wanna risk, look. You see that? Let this be a cautionary tale for you. Yo, I feel like makeup artists are looking at this and being like, bitch, what is she doing? I'm almost done. This is not that bad. I've been so hesitant to do these little makeup tutorials, but I'm so glad that the first time that I do it is with Selena's products. But it will make sense because Selena was the person that really inspired me to be an entertainer. I am going to do my eyebrows now, right? I use this brush. I don't know from what brand it is, but I've had this brush now for 20 years. Here we go. This guy is really giving me a migraine. Now we're moving on to La Leyenda. And this is an extra dimension skin finish. And in French is Badia Lemonier. Ooh, que lindo te shimmer. It's not too much. It's not too crazy. I like it. I can tell. If you can't tell, then I don't know what to tell you. So I'm just gonna define my cheekbones a little bit like that. I don't know if you could tell, but you gotta suck in your face a little bit like this. Like that, you look like you did a little bit of mess and you got a couple tigers. So I feel like this right now is giving me the definition that I want for my standards, not for your standards. If you don't like it, you can suck my ass. And then now for the last look, we're about to, we're done. Uh, it's the dewy finish in French, fini All right, let me stop. Uh, the dewy finish from NYX Professional Makeup Setting Spray. I'll just put it like this. I don't think I should be spraying that much, but again, yo soy una exagera. Say it with me, exagera. Uh, I like to exaggerate things. I'm so dramatic, even with my makeup. So now it gives me that doughy look, that dewy finish, and I think with the luminous putty, it helps. This is the look that I would go outside with, but I do kind of want to try out the really, really red one, just for Selena's sake. What do you think, guys? This is the liquid lipstick. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh wow. The way this goes on your lips is insane. Oh wow. Oh, it's over. This is beautiful. This is my Selena look. I could fall in love. Anyway guys, that was my tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And try to stay productive during this quarantine. Love you guys and like, share, demon on fuse. Do not forget to watch it.